everybody, this is Praxis, and today River and I were working more on this hearth. Uh, River helped a lot uh, at the beginning part of the day, he got a little tired midway through, but still got me a lot of bricks, and then I kind of finished up uh, on the last load of cement. It's just about time to go right now, uh, though, and the one thing that I'm going to make sure that I do before I leave is to take this excess uh, concrete and wipe it off. That you can see this area here I did yesterday where I kind of gave it a, a you know, wiping down so you can actually see the brick. Here it's all covered in concrete. And uh, what I've been using is uh, one of my preps. Uh, these are uh, pieces of old jeans from decades ago. They've been hanging around forever. And I was able to locate them to use for this. Normally, uh, for this kind of thing, you would oftentimes use a, uh, a kind of a sponge on a handle for smoothing this stuff out. I've got one of those, but apparently I didn't clean it off well enough last time I used it. It was all plugged up with cement. Couldn't use it, and I had to kind of figure out a way of doing this. And fortunately, we've started moving all of our stuff, uh, uh, preps and things, all over into the shed. And I was, even though it was not organized, I was able to kind of locate where these, uh, the big bag of scrap cloth was and uh, was able to get these. And this is going to smooth out the, uh, the mortar between the joints. And I'm also lifting some of it up and off and I'm wiping it, uh, washing it off in this little tub. You can see at the beginning, it just makes things look like they're worse. But after you give it pass after pass after pass, you're going to start lifting up all the excess, and it'll start looking like this. The other nice thing about doing this is that it's taking up the surface of the brick, uh, which, you know, brick isn't the strongest material in the world. It's taking the surface of the brick, and it is uh, uh, kind of impregnating it with a, a strengthening uh, concrete layer. Sort of like if you go to the dentist and they put like a, a layer over your teeth, uh, like fluoride treatments for kids or whatever. It's sort of... Sort of like that, where it's strengthening the enamel, so to speak, of your, of your bricks. It takes a lot of passes, though. Thanks for watching.